Good morning, welcome to Breakfast with Sally Nugent and Charlie State. Our headlines for you today. Thank you, Charlie. Two teenagers will begin life sentences today for the murder of 16-year-old Brianna Jai. The schoolgirl was stabbed 28 times in a park in Cheshire last year. Scarlett Jenkinson and Eddie Ratcliffe were named publicly for the first time yesterday as they were sentenced. Our North of England reporter, Rome Bridge, has more. The search for the man suspected of carrying out a chemical attack on a woman and her two daughters in South London has entered its third day. Abdul Izadi was last seen on the London Underground at King's Cross on Wednesday. Our reporter, Graeme Satchel, has the very latest. Well, our news correspondent Simon Jones is outside Scotland Yard for us this morning. Uh, morning, Simon. What more have police been able to tell you? The US Secretary of State is expected to travel to the Middle East tomorrow to try to secure the release of all of the remaining hostages held by Hamas in Gaza. Nearly 12,000 unmarried parents whose partners have died risk missing out on an estimated £175 million of benefit payments. Last year, the law changed to give cohabiting couples the same right to bereavement support as married partners. But thousands of people are yet to claim. Radio 4's Moneybox reporter Dan Whitworth has more. Time now just came up to quarter past six. Basketball legend Michael Jordan is still breaking records despite retiring from the sport more than two decades ago for old trainers. Yes, quite special old trainers. Isn't though. it, Matt? What do you think? Now, at 18 minutes past six, let's have a look at this morning's papers, starting with the time. Two years to the day since devolution collapsed following a boycott over post-Brexit trade rules. Power sharing will return to Northern Ireland later. Sinn Féin's Michelle O'Neill will make history by becoming Stormont's Nationalist First Minister. Let's go to our correspondent. Now, the annual Six Nations Rugby Union Championship is officially underway today. England will take on Italy. Wales are going to host Scotland. Mike is in. <laughs> it was a very funny show. <laughs> very true to life as well, Charlie, yeah, isn't it? True thing. I think you'll find uh, all those egos. Donkeys. There are a few. <laughs> yeah. Drop Dead Donkey Stage Show, already on tour. Visit 19 venues across the UK until June. <laughs> now at 6.37, it's time for this week's episode of The Travel Show.